Hello friends and welcome back to another Disney vlog. The last time we went to Disney we had such a good time that literally on the way home we booked this next trip and so we are back. First off on the way to Disney we saw this giant rainbow that was there for like the longest time. I thought it was a pretty good omen because you could see both sides of it like look how clear that is. It was insane. Anyway, um, we went over Memorial Weekend, so we drove down on Friday night and left on Monday, so it was a super quick little visit, obligatory picture of, you know, the sign at Disney World. And while we were there, this time we stayed at Port Orleans French Quarter. Nope, nope, last time we stayed at the French Quarter, this time we stayed at Riverside. So at Port Orleans Riverside, it's a much larger resort, we actually picked it because it was dog friendly and we thought about taking our dog and in the end we did not. But we stayed in these super cool rooms. They're called the Royal Guest Rooms and they are just so much fun. They're like really well themed. It's all like princesses and princes. And the whole idea is that you're like there and it's very Princess Tiana because it's New Orleans. And so she's like pretending that you're like her guests at the Royal Hotel. And it's just so much fun. Like, I don't know why they don't have all of their rooms this cool because I mean, like seriously, fireworks, what else do you need? Um, it was amazing, super cool. I will say that Port Orleans French Quarter was probably as a resort, I liked that one better, but we were very impressed by Riverside as well, I do have to say. Also, did you notice that the Prince at Snow White doesn't have a name? because I didn't realize that until we stayed here and he doesn't have a name on his little thing. Um, this was my favorite little accent. It's the magic lamp on the sink. Absolutely hilarious. Anyway, Friday night we didn't get to do much because we got there kind of late. And so on Friday we just got there, hung around the hotel, watched TV, that sort of thing. And then Saturday we headed out to Disney Springs. Now, Port Orleans, both French Quarter and Riverside, as well as Key West and Saratoga, all have access to Disney Springs in the boats. So we hopped on the boat on Saturday to go over to Disney Springs, which is really nice because it's, you know, air conditioning. Here's my outfit. This little romper was so cute, super comfy, and I got so many compliments. So I will link all of my outfits down below, actually, in case you're curious about clothes because I'm always curious about clothes. So we took the boat over to Disney Springs, did some shopping, went to Haleo. We've never been there before, but it was so good. It's like a Spanish tapas restaurant. So they're all like small sharing plates. We had like a cheese plate and we had some sausage and we had um, like fried cheese stick kind of things. Um, I think they had chicken in them also. And then we had some shrimp and you just like share everything. This dessert was a 50th anniversary special and it was so good. It was like chocolate, chocolate, chocolate with raspberry or cherry glaze or something to that effect. I bought a new lounge fly because you know, you just have to. And we, yeah, hung out at Disney Springs. We went back to the hotel and chilled for a little bit, went to the pool and then got dressed for dinner. And we had dinner at Boma, which is a restaurant inside of the Animal Kingdom Lodge. So we have to take a bus to either Disney Springs or one of the parks and then transfer to one of the buses that takes you to Animal Kingdom Lodge from there. Um, but it was so worth it. So y'all, the restaurants have like the best food is what we are finding recently. Animal Kingdom Lodge is super cool because it is on, I don't know what they call this, like a nature preserve. It's not really a nature preserve because it's definitely not natural, but they have um, a bunch of like African animals. So they have like giraffes, and zebra and all of these things that you can like see from the windows, which was super cool. Boma is a buffet and I do have to say that I personally think the desserts were the best part. Next time I'm getting one plate of food, two plates of desserts. That's my master plan, but it was delicious. So good, so good. Um, and we had a great time. On Sunday, we were headed to Animal Kingdom, which was really fun. So before we went, we went over to just the dining hall. All of the resorts have like a little dining hall and you can get stuff like this. I did not get Mickey waffles because the line was insane. <laughs> So I had a cinnamon roll instead, but it was fine. And then we headed over to Animal Kingdom. We took the buses over there. I had only been to Animal Kingdom one other time. And that time I think we had park hoppers. So we were only there for like a couple hours. So I really enjoyed going there this time. And I think we only got through half of the park, even though we were there like the entire day. 
So after we, you know, checked out the tree of life, we headed straight back to the Africa section. If you're not familiar, um, there's like different sections and each section is based upon different areas of the world because they have animals from all the different areas of the world. And we went to the Kilimanjaro safaris because this was what I really, really wanted to do. So they load you up in these like safari looking bus vehicle type things and you go through this um, they like drive you down this little dirt road in the middle of what looks like, you know, the wilderness and the animals are just kind of roaming around. They are kind of secluded, but they're like, obviously they're not just roaming around Disney world. Like there's fences somewhere, but they don't appear to be like in cages or anything. As you can tell, like literally you'll see later on, there was a giraffe super close to me like a couple feet away it was insane um and so it's just really cool to see like all of these animals just like roaming around like they would be in the wild we did not see the lions this time but we did see giraffes and zebras and elephants and all of that fun stuff so after that we went back and picked up a little snack of Dole Whip because you gotta have Dole Whip. Um, I got this one called a Simba Sunrise. So it had like strawberry in it and it was delightful. Here you can see my super cool Animal Kingdom ears. And we went to Rafiki's Planet Watch. So this was interesting. Um, you hop on this little like train and it takes you to like, I wanna call it an island, but it's not really an island because it's not surrounded by water, but it's like a little conservatory. And so there was like a video feature that wasn't running this particular day. So we didn't get to see that. Um, oh, here's my Mufasa backpack because it needed a spotlight. Um, but you follow Rafiki and you go over and it's like got all of these signs that tell you all about nature and how you can help nature and stuff like that. And this is where like the video feature was. And then on the back side, it has like a drawing class, which was really fun. So we learned how to draw Tigger. Well, I learned how to draw Tigger. Andrew did not want to draw Tigger, but you know, to each his own. And there's also like a petting zoo, although we did not do the petting zoo because it was like goats and sheep and things that we have back here at home in Georgia. So then we stopped at Nomad Lounge for some sliders and some churros and some drinks. It was right there where that little balcony is. So right over the water, which was cool. Um, they had a bunch of characters on boats that kept going through so you'd see like Donald Duck in like his safari outfit, super cool. This area is Pandora. So we checked out all of Pandora after we did all of Africa. So we also did some stuff I didn't show you. Like we did some of the trails and we saw the Lion King show, checked out Pandora. These clips are from the Navi River journey, which was really cool. Um, both literally like it was cool inside there and also like it was really interesting. Although Andrew had not seen Avatar, so he was a little more confused. I have seen it, although it has been quite a while. Um, but yeah, it was a really fun one to go through and we had a good time. After we checked out Pandora, we went back up into the front and like went through all of the shops because I love going through the shops. All the shops have different things. And so if you go to like the shops here and the shops there, they all have different things at different places, which I just find really interesting. Here you can see, um, oh no, I can't remember. I haven't seen Avatar in a long time, so I'm not remembering any, I guess the one of the Navi people, that's it. One of the Navi people singing. I can see how this would be super confusing if you had not seen the movie. But I found some Dole Whip AirPod holders, which was like life. And then that mug is the tree of life. Under the tree of life, there is a like Bugs Life kind of show. These posters were cracking me up because they're all different like musicals, but bug themed. Hilarious. We picked up some ice cream on the way out and then we stopped into the lounge at our resort to get some food. Y'all, we were just gonna get some snacks, but it was so good that we went back to our hotel and our, our room and like hung out and then canceled our reservations and went back and ate more food. We have pimento cheese fritters, tater tots with like pulled pork and wings. They were so good. Best food we had all week. Um, on Monday, we headed over to Disney Springs, picked up a Father's Day gift for my father because Grubby is his spirit animal. Got some butter bars, which is the most amazing snack in all of Disney World. We had them last time and we found them at Goofy's this time, which was super exciting. And then we went to Planet Hollywood for lunch. We always get this appetizer sampler. That's what the little Ferris wheel thing is. It's delicious. My favorite is the tostadas. And they also have the really yummy chicken and then we get extra chicken. So that's our go to one of our absolute favorites 
and all of Disney World. So we had a great time. I hope you enjoyed this and it was helpful in your, you know, planning purposes or at least entertaining. And thanks so much for watching. See you next time. Bye.